guys, it's Michelle with Design Home Daily Review. Well, we've got the daily for you and a tip for the day, so let's get started. Today's daily challenge is what a view. Design a modern living room for a hillside mansion in Vancouver, British Columbia. Well, I'll tell you, their view pretty well stunk. It, it was a view of a brick wall. Let me show you. But first, let me show you this cool prize. <laughs> it's an Anthony Barata. That's right. Worth 1,419 diamonds. It's a high port accent table. And you know what? I love it. What an amazing view of Vancouver. A brick wall. <laughs> it's just kind of funny, you guys. It looks like a schoolhouse or something. Anyways. I do like the room though. I love all these windows allowing the sunlight to come in. I like how it shows that in here. So very cool. Well, let's see what the admin picks are. Christina or is it Crystal Tina? I'm sorry. I don't know if I said that properly, but guess what? You're an admin pick today and I can see why. I love your design. It is gorgeous. I love how you matched the furniture with this light fixture up here. You went with a gray and white, and it just looks fantastic, girl. Just check out these chairs in the little dining area over here. Really nice job. I love this little side table. Very, very cute. And you just did a great job, girl. Congratulations. Next is Jean, Jean M, and I love your design, girl. I love this little black and white, monochromatic, whatever you want to call it. It is absolutely gorgeous, and you put a little pop of color in here with a little pink. I love it, and I can see the detail on the chairs in here in the dining room, and this cute, cute little table lamp right here that kind of has a tinge of pink added to it. Very, very nicely done, girl, and congratulations. Great job. I love it. Denise, you are another admin pick today, and I love your design, girl. I love this little turquoise added in here. It just really puts a lot of contrast to this room, and it just looks so gorgeous. I just love it. You did a fine job on this. I love this coffee table right here for all of you new people that just came on board. Denise is trying to show you or teach you a lesson right now. This coffee table right here is like one of the main voters for fives coffee table. So you need to go ahead and put that in your inventory. This is a hot item right here. And of course, this rug that used to be called the magic rug, it is back, you guys. Go ahead and put it back in your inventory. It's another hot item. And just look how cute this little side table is. How adorable is that? I love it, girl. Congratulations. Great job. Sha -na 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 -na. <laughs> I'm sorry. I had to do that. Shauna, you are next. Girl, check it out. You are an admin pick today. And I can see why. I love this design. It is so adorable. I love this chair. Everybody knows I like the outline furniture. And this chair, oh, it's just one of my favorites already. It has so much detail. So very cute. And you chose these little black and white chairs for the dining room, which added so much contrast over here. It was so great. And yeah, I just love how you put all of this together. And I love your artwork you chose too. It just really sets it all off. Great job, girl. Congratulations. Jennifer, you are an admin pick, girlfriend. I love your design. I love these little cute green chairs. They're so adorable. You went with the brown tones, and I think it just looks fabulous, girl. And I love your little furniture pick over here, too, with the white and this green rug. Very, very nicely done. I love it, girl. And last but certainly not least, it's Krista's. I love it, Krista. It is so cute. I love this little side chair that you chose. Look at all the detail in it. It is so adorable right here. It sets. And I love the little gray and white chairs. I've seen those in the inventory. These things are super, super cute. And they're 
pretty well decent priced if I'm thinking this is the right, the same one here. These little metal chairs. But I love this all together in here, girlfriend. And I love the, the floor lamp that you chose. Sorry, I'm having a hard time talking tonight. But I just love it. It just looks so cute. Great job, girl. I made this my thumbnail. You did a banged up job. And I love it. And now for Bandejos, tip of the day. So for today's tip, it's actually a recycled tip. I've done this in a video before, but we have so many new people that have come on board now. I'm going to start recycling some of these tips because we're playing the game all the time. We may forget about them from a video. So here's the thing. When you do a dining room and you have six placements and you purchased a dining room chair you only get five uses so for some people it's a big deal that you would have to go buy a whole nother set of dining room chairs well you don't have to do that i'm going to show you how it's done you can actually borrow that dining room chair ah some of you didn't know that so this is a good tip for you, but this isn't the best dining room to show this to you with because it required so many chairs, eight, but we're going to pretend like it's six, okay? So what I've done is I've already filled up five spots of my dining room chairs here, and you see it says zero. So now I'm going to go in and I'm going to borrow from someone who has this chair. So I went in to my friends list and none of them had the chairs. I got down to, whoops, I don't know. It's not even showing her name. Okay, Risa. Thank you, Risa. I uh, did borrow from you today and I appreciate that. But um, when you get down to Risa, we're going to click on there. She had the chair. So I'm going to place this extra chair right there because I only have six placements. Okay, pretend you don't see these two right here. And so this is going to cover me so I don't have to go purchase another $495 for that chair, even though this one was kind of cheap. You follow what I'm saying? It could have been the $3,160 one. And then this would have really came in handy. So that's how you do that, you guys. You borrow that one last chair instead of buying the whole set all over again. I am super happy about this. We have 242 members now in our group. Can you believe that? We grew to 242 members. Now, I will say that if people are sending some requests here, we're usually getting about 25 a day, sometimes even more um request but if they're not filling out the little questionnaire that's attached to that then you know we can't let you in and so we we need to make sure we're trying to protect everybody in the group by making sure that these aren't computers or hackers or something so that is why not everybody's getting in now if you know somebody that didn't get in and you know that they're legit just send me a message with the request again and we'll go ahead and let them in you know because sometimes this questionnaire is not prompting to them i found that out by talking directly to a couple of people so anyways help me welcome all of the new group members you guys we're just glad to have you right before i put the video together i went on the group page and I've noticed a lot of people questioning, you know, like, what has happened? Like, why are my scores all of a sudden dropping? What's going on with the voting? And we've been having this discussion, so I went ahead and put this up here. It's like a voter research. So add all of your five-star designs from August, September, and October. Okay, for the, I know we're not to October yet, but we're going to put Octobers in this as well. <clears throat> excuse me we got allergies here so bad in texas so anyways um but you have your august and september that's going to give us a really good idea over the last two months what's been going on so just put your five stars in there so we can all take a look and see what actually went through now i don't care if you if you got a five star on a design that you thought was not so good you know i've seen a couple of people say that like They've commented on their own design, like, I can't believe this got a five, but I'll take it. 
you go ahead and put those in here. That's important. Those are very important to this research. We want to see what are the eye-catching things in there that voters are biting at, okay? So put all your five-star designs in here, and we will give you an update as to the certain items that are in common and everything. And so, you know, you may want to put that in your inventory at a later time or right now. Okay, listen up my seasoned designers here. Okay, you are a seasoned designer. If you've ever been in the top 100, if you've ever been in the top 10, top 5, in the top spot, you are considered a seasoned designer. I need you to come over here and critique this little section right here. Come by daily and see if anybody has put anything in here. It is very, very important um, to help these people, okay? We've got a lot of designers on here that want help. They want to beat the game. They want to be in the top 100. They want to be in the top 10, you know? Let's help them get there. And how we do that is we need to help them critique the designs that they, they have that they're working on right now. Maybe they haven't submitted it yet. This is the place to put those designs. And maybe it's already been uh, judged already and scored and they want to put it in here and say, what happened? I've seen a lot of people post that lately. This is a place to do that. Come and post it over here. Let's have a discussion in this album daily over this and let's help these folks who want to be in the top 100 get there. Now, I get it. There's a lot of people that just design for themselves and they don't care about the score. That's fine too. We love everybody in this group. But for those who really, really want to get in the top 100, come on over here, put your designs in here, and we're going to have some people come on over and critique those for you and to help you. Now, you may have to put specifics in there you may have to screenshot some furniture you guys denise bonnie krista you know karen jennifer uh we're, we're talking kim ariana all of you maria you guys you know you may have to come in and screenshot a piece of furniture and help these people and show them you know this is what you need over here so anyways i would appreciate it you guys and let's see how this works for a while let's just see one more thing, and we're going to end this video. I am sorry this has gone so long, but right here, I've also added another album, okay? And it's it says, like, you know, just put some furniture pieces in here, rugs, etc., that do not score well. If you have tried these over and over, and they have never scored well in your designs, we need to know what those are. Because people need to have a place to go to and scan, you know, and look and say, oh, I was going to use that on a design, but it didn't score well. At least lets them know that these certain pieces just haven't been scoring well for others, you know. All right, you guys, that's it for today. I'll be back with some more for you tomorrow. We'll talk to you soon. Bye now.